There was a girl who was the most popular girl in the whole school. Her classmates worshipped her every time she passed through the halls. There was one who wanted the fame and popularity. This young lady put a stop to this popular girl. The girl was found dead at the bottom of the pool, and her name was never spoken of again. Her name was Vanessa. Chris, wake up. We need to get ready. We have a big exam today, and that determines if we pass the grade or not. So get your butt up. Ugh, fine. But I only got four hours of sleep because I was studying for that stupid exam. What's taking so long? We have to be ready in an hour. Chris won't get her lazy bum out of bed. I'm moving. Gosh, I just really wanted some more sleep. It's fine. We just need to gather our stuff and head to the bathing quarters. Okay, my first class is computers. Mine too. I really don't want to take the exam. It sounds intense. Well, we have to, and I'm just as nervous as you are. Okay, we will meet back here after our first classes. Sounds good to me. Time to take the exam. She did it. What? What? Huh? D did anybody hear that? Hear what? Oh, n never mind, never mind. No talking during the exam. Finally, the day's over. Gosh. I know, right? But guys, I have to tell you something. So basically, while we were taking an exam, I heard this voice. And it was saying that she did it. 
Who did what? That's eerie. I don't know who did what, but we should probably just head to bed. I agree. It's getting pretty late. Yeah, I'm getting really tired. She did it. Ah! What was that? Guys, guys! Ugh, what? Ugh, what time is it? I heard a voice. What voice? What did the voice say to you? It said she did it. That's what the voice said to me. Guys, this is all nonsense. I think we should just head to bed. I think you guys are just hallucinating or something. I don't think we are. Something's going on. Yeah, I agree, but I just need to get some sleep. We have school tomorrow. How about we talk about this tomorrow? I'm getting tired, and I think you guys are talking nonsense. Okay, whatever. Let's just head to bed. I swear I heard something. <sighs> guys, time to get up and start our day. Ugh, okay. Ugh, fine. Why don't we all jump off the diving boards together? Yeah, that sounds fun. That was fun. Yeah, that was fun. Let's do it again. I don't think I'm going to go again. I'm going to sit this one out. You guys can go, though. Okay. We're not hallucinating. Well, let's just not think about it and let's have some fun and let's go off the diving board. Don't you think it's a little odd that we've heard the voice a couple times and Tris has never heard the voice before? Yeah, that's a little sus. Maybe she'll get it eventually. Yeah, but for now, let's not tell her. I agree, but we should probably head back where where Tris is. She's probably wondering where we are. What took you so long? Um, uh, there was kind of like a long line on the diving board. But there was no line at the diving board. Never mind. Guys, I'm getting kind of tired. I think I'm gonna go take a nap. Okay. Remember how we heard that voice at the diving board? Yeah, that was pretty weird. If Tris isn't hearing it, then why are we? I don't know. Maybe there's something in the school library that can help. Okay, but first we gotta make sure Tris is asleep. It looks like she's asleep. Yeah, let's get out of here. something what is it it says here that there once was an occurrence where a spirit came back from the dead to talk to people why us though i don't know why the spirit would talk to us but maybe i can go on my computer and do some research later yeah that will give us some more information in these crusty musty dusty books <sighs> why is it so quiet where are they Oh, I found something. What did you find? It says here that if a person is murdered by another, then that triggers a portal to open, and that allows spirits to come back and haunt their murderer. So magic is really real? I guess so, but what does that have to do with... What are you guys doing here? Um, nothing. We just decided to, um, uh, come here to do 
Because I've done some homework. Uh, yeah, homework. Why didn't you guys ask me to join you? Uh, we will next time. We just didn't want to interrupt you sleeping. Well, thank you, I guess. Um, we should head back to our dorm. It's past curfew. Good morning. Time to get up. Ugh, that was the worst sleep ever. I have an idea to wake Triss up. What is it? This is my idea. Perfect. Um, excuse me, you guys could have just, like, shook me awake instead of harassing me with pillows in my face. We're gonna be late for the assembly, Chris. Okay, I'm moving, I'm moving. Good jeez. I wonder what the assembly is about. I don't know, maybe I can, maybe it's put up on my phone. Oh, it looks like everyone's name is in a raffle and whoever gets picked gets to do stunts with the cheerleaders. I hope that's not me. Watch it be me. I hope it's not me. I can't do any stunts. <laughs> Guys, I don't want to be worried about it. The chances of us getting picked is so slim. But there's always that one chance. Yeah, you never know. Anyways, we should probably just go find our seats on the bleachers. Introducing our headmistress of our lovely school. Welcome students to today's assembly. In today's assembly, we're going to be having the cheer squad come and perform for us. One lucky student will get picked out of the raffle to do stunts with the cheerleaders. Now I'll pull out my scroll and we will decide who the person will be. We will now pick the contestant. We're raffling and... The chosen contestant is Tris Whopper. Womp womp. Shut up! Come on down. I can't believe I'm doing this. Woo! Go Tris! That 
girl in the middle looks familiar. Yeah, something kind of off about her. What happened? Basically, this girl that that was holding you in the stunt looked really familiar, by the way. She was holding you, and she dropped you, and then you were on the ground, and you kind of blacked out. Yeah, but that basically sums it up. I think I'm going to go. I feel much better. How about me and Thomas go get you a snack? Okay, that sounds good. Don't I think that the person that was holding Tris in the cheerleading stunt looked awfully like the voice that we've been hearing? Do you think the voice has something to do with Tris? Yeah, maybe we need to confront her about it or something. The girl that dropped me looked awfully familiar, but I can't put my finger on it. Oh well, I might as well just catch up on some homework. You were the one that dropped me. Are you not gonna let me from somewhere else? No, I don't think so. Wait. No way. Vanessa, is that you? Bingo. Why are you here? Revenge. But I should be the one asking you the questions. Why did you kill me? I'm not telling you. Fine. But you should have answered my question. But anyways, your friends will find out. Find it out sooner or later. They'll find out sooner or later? What is that supposed to mean? Let's go get these snacks to Tris. Okay, sounds good. <gasps> that the voice? We should follow her. What is this? I don't know. What is this place? Wait, is that her? You can call me Vanessa. Wait, the popular girl? That drowned in the pool four years ago? Wait, it can't be her. Why have you been talking to us? To kill your best friend, just pop her up, up. But why? She ended me. I'm gonna help you guys by teaching you how to do this. Wait, Wait, that's magic? He's gonna teach us This is where their footprints led. Why are they in the wall? We have to keep this a secret. Oh. Keep what a secret? And why'd you guys come out of the wall? No reason at all. We were just uh, getting a snack. So there's snacks inside a wall? Is that what you're telling me? No, we were getting the snacks, but then we were looking at the uh, honor roll. Oh my gosh, you guys should stop lying to me. Just tell me what you guys are doing in there. An element club. <laughs> Well, then tell us what you did. What do you mean what I did? Come on, you know what you did. Four years ago, freshman year. Um, I don't know what you guys are talking about. Uh, yes you do. Uh, yes you do. We know your secret. I don't know what you guys are talking about, but bye. Hey, come back. Yeah, we're not finished talking with you yet.
Tessa, it's time. Do you guys really want to know why I pushed her in the water? Yeah, I do, actually. I was envious. You pushed her in the water because you were jealous? Because she got so much attention, it blew my head off. But Tris, it doesn't matter if she gets attention. She had the power. The power to create things. I was just a silly old human. You know why they banned powers? Why did they ban powers? Because people like her were too powerful. But didn't you feel pretty powerful because you killed somebody? Exactly. That was my plan, to be more powerful than that little twerp. I also wanted to be popular, so looks like I got what I wanted. Falling on your face in front of the whole school on the football field, is that what you wanted? That was just an inconvenience. We have to do what we have to do. Are you guys Thomas and Tessa? Yep, that's us. Hi, I'm Tris, your new roommate. Uh, uh, 